I want to say thank you to the EA team and the Madden team for helping your boy out. I was able to get early content, capture early content, and they are the homies. They are too real for that, and I appreciate them. Now, I'm going to be taking on Koopa in this. His link will be down below in the description. And uh, this is the first Mutt Drafts on my channel. You guys know I'm going to be rocking Mutt Drafts a lot. It is my favorite game mode, and you guys love when I play it, so I already know. You already know I'm going to do that for you guys now. A regular draft is the first one. Might as well do a regular to see what they got. And there is 20 rounds now in the Mutt 18 draft. You guys do see the up on the left-hand side. We're in round 4 of 20 right here. Last year was 15, I believe. This year, they added five more rounds. And I also heard that in mud drafts, that it's going to be really, really stacked this year. You know how last year it was kind of, uh, I was, it wasn't bad, but it just wasn't as stacked as 16. Well, this year is going to be amazing. You guys are going to be so impressed. And you guys are going to fall in love with the game. Oh, my goodness. So, right here, we are going to draft whoever we please whoever we want and so far i'm seeing elites all across the board so i'm happy with that and we're going into round seven now we do get a goal round it's okay i ain't tripping it's early on we're gonna be uh getting whoever in this round but also another quick fact another fun fact um the mutt drafts are gonna be updated all the time it's just some new cards that will be going into mutt will be dropping i believe in mud drafts as well so it's gonna be a lot of fun playing this, a lot of fun playing Mutt, cannot wait. And look at round nine, amazing. Brandon Cooks, Jordan Nelson, and Julian Edelman. This looks like a receiver round. I could pick anybody on this board right here and I'll be happy, but I'm gonna go with the speedy. Brandon Cooks, I mean, that man is too quick. The man just went to the Patriots and I'm not even gonna lie, the Patriots just got even better than they were last year. And last year, they were the best. So, I mean, what is going on with the Patriots? Why can't my Baltimore Ravens do something? I mean, we got Jimmy Matthew. That's a big pickup. But Joe Flacco is hurt. Come on, dog. Really? Really? But anyways, round 11. Latavius Murray. Theoretic and Spencer Ware. Another round of just straight um, one position players. That was like a halfback round. A running back round. And there's a cornerback round. I can go with anybody on this board. And I will be happy. But you guys already know who I got to go with, dog. Chris Harris Jr. will be selected. Now I have DRC. Chris Harris Jr. And Sheed. 82 overall, a 90 overall, and an 89 overall. And here is a legend round. You guys are seeing some of the first legends in Mutt 18, Mutt Drafts 18. And you guys see Marshall Falk. We got Anthony Munoz. Munoz, Munoz. And we got Chris Carter, who is, I think, making his first appearance in Mutt, at least that I remember, uh, this year in Mutt Drafts as well. And uh, I did pick up Chris Carter because I already had a running back in Latavius Murray. Round 15, Jarvis Landry, Foster, uh, Conklin, right tackle, a left guard, a wide receiver. Now, I already have so many wide receivers, but it's all good because I want to pick another one. Jarvis Landry will be my second string. I'll put Brandon Cooks in the slot because he's so fast. And Chris Carter will be our main receiver. But then look. Tight end, receiver, and receiver. We're getting a lot of players that I already have. I mean, I already have a tight end. I got to go and get another tight end. Here's a quarterback round. Easy pick for me right here. I'm going to get Cam Newton. The man is a beast. The man can run. He can throw. He, he's, well, he is durable, but he gets cracked a lot. The man gets hit a lot and doesn't get his call, so I feel bad for him sometimes. Uh, but he's still a beast, man. He is very, very good. Round 19. One more round after this. You guys see we got a defensive tackle, a center, a left tackle. And we went with the defensive tackle in Jackson. Now, Marcel Darius, Jarrell Casey, and Joel uh, Betonio. Is he Italian? Okay, that's a cool last name. But you guys, this see 87 overall defense, 77 offense, 84 overall. Now, you're like, wow, a stacked defense and a bad offense? Well, I didn't really pick any offensive line that much, so it kind of messed me up. But still, the defense should be able to hold us up, hopefully. We'll see in the gameplay coming up. But right here, let's go over the team, and then we'll jump into the game. You guys see who we're rocking with on offense, and we have a lot of good players. We have elites everywhere, basically. Receivers, running backs, uh, quarterback, tight end, 
We have two also uh, elite players on the offensive line. I should have probably gone out to like a right tackle or left tackle, but hey, we'll do what we gotta do and hopefully they can do something for us. Now on the defensive side of the football, you guys see who we're rocking with and we got Jarrell Freeman, uh, we have a left outside and a right outside. We have very good cornerbacks. I'm talking about two very elites. Then we also have another elite that's an A2 overall. And then we have a defensive line that can get to the quarterback. We have a bad strong safety though. We got a silver strong safety. <laughs> but it's all good. I believe he can hold up for us. And let's see what we can do in this game right here. First play of the game. And you guys already know I'm the Baltimore Ravens jerseys. And Cooper will be the Patriots now. Stop right there, and another short pass, a big hit, and oh, we fumbled, but we do not pick up the ball, unfortunately, so it is third and five. And Cooper gets hit behind the line, and he drops the ball, dog. The hits in this game are brutal, fourth and five. Can he keep the drive alive? I am not sure, but yes, he does. Another tackle, but this one was past the first down marker, so... Hey, first down for him, fourth and one. The ball is thrown once again, and oh my goodness. Mismatch, nightmare at the tight end position. And he has Aaron Rodgers as his quarterback, and you guys already know how much of a struggle that is because he is a beast. He is a problem. And just like that, we are down early on in this game. He scores a touchdown, and we need to play well right here. And oh my gosh. Right when we get the ball, we throw a pick. Richard Sherman was there. Oh my goodness. And there goes the quarterback down behind the line. Aaron Rodgers was sacked. And that's a very good job by us. Now, you guys do see. I'm not sure if you guys actually see, but do you guys see what's going on with the stadium effects right here? It was a little bit like, I would say, darker before, but then like the sun is moving left to right or right to left. I don't know. But do you guys see the effects? It's very, very cool. And it gives it like a really cool look. Oh my, again. This is so dope. I love how he did that this year. Um, but we're already down, man. By 10 and a big catch by Brandon Cooks. He's going to be a big help for us, hopefully, going down the stretch. Third and eight. We need this Jarvis Landry in the slot. Catches the ball. A very, very good job. Second and seven. We need a TD. But this time we go behind the line. Cam Newton is sacked. Not a good job, but here we go. Brandon Cooks crossed the middle, and the speed is too much for anybody. You could be the best receiver in the league, or a receiver at the cornerback. I mean, you could be a receiver, but the best cornerback in the league is going to have a problem with Brandon Cooks because of that speed. But let's see what we do right here. We throw it short. Latavius Murray is not able to spin around his defender. It's all good. In the hood, so we're going to do right here is first and 10. Hopefully, Cam Newton. And stay protected. And Brandon Cooks is over in the middle, and the speed is too much. Number 14 burns his way down the middle of the field. And that's a TD for us. Extra point will be good. So we're only down by three. In the third, Aaron Rodgers throws it, and just like that, we give a big play right here. Now, these are some of the first times I'm playing Madden 18, so I hope you guys do understand. I'm going to get better. Trust your boy. Hashtag stamp, I'm going to get better. Um, practice makes perfect, obviously. And, oh, what a big hit. How did he hold on to that pass? Aaron Rodgers so far is 7 for 12, 91 yards. Make that 8 for 13 and add about 15 yards right there. He is shredding me up. Cooper is doing his thing. And here is a run untouched into the end zone in the fourth quarter. And it does not look good for us. Le'Veon Bell is his running back. No wonder he's running well. There goes Chris Carter, and he has not been having a big game for us, unfortunately. Fourth and inches, I need this. Big time, I need go Cooks. Oh, my gosh. I'm struggling down by 10, and it looks like I might be down by more, but that was a big hit right there. We were able to knock the ball out of the receiver's hands. Aaron Rodgers is elusive, and he finds a player in the back of the end zone once again. We're playing terrible. We're playing terrible. But hey, we cannot quit. We are not quitters. I'm not a quitter. You're not a quitter. So let's keep on playing, man. We never give up, even if we're down by a hundo. Actually, if I'm down by a hundo, I might give up. I ain't gonna lie. But down by this much, I'm gonna just keep trying. I'm sleep. I'm very sleep. I mean, I ain't giving up, man. Let's keep going. 
down by 24 under a minute left it's all good we understand the outcome of this game what's gonna happen but hey play man keep on playing two sacks for uh jackson and two tackles on the day we get the ball right back and look right in the middle of the field our elite tight end is open good catch for him now we have thrown three picks today unfortunately but hey don't give up never give up and then we do a pick again did i mention that i'm sleep oh my goodness 24 to 7 is the final score and we get dominated today but it's all good madden 18 will be a game that we play a lot and hopefully we get a lot better at so i can get some dubs but anyways hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did you already know what to do hit that thumbs up also subscribe to the channel koopa's link is down below make sure you guys follow him as well stay tuned guys for more videos coming out soon and i am out